Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs and today we're doing the ultimate randomizer. Randomized skills, randomized gear, and we're going to be playing Gage the Mechromancer. Let's jump right in. I know that it's been a little while since I uploaded a Borderlands 2 video, but you know, sometimes you, you, you don't learn to appreciate something until it's gone. 52% max health is a nice start. 62% cooldown is incredibly good as well. I do like to grab a shield and maybe a class mod, maybe even a relic. Um from here because between each between each tier your randomized gear gets gets re-rolled so i like to kind of have you know a selection of different weapons also these weapons are not random in my hands let's just drop these bad layers and start from completely scratch number one the scarlet Lico. it has some serious potential it's got an annoying sound but we might be able to get a, above get a, around that this is like a it's like a half fire teeth of terramorphous but it's had but it's based off of a saw rifle ammo. Could be interesting. What is this? Second wind health plus 320% is kind of useless. All right, let's see. Captain Scarlet's Pimpernel. It's got 1.14 damage. His fire is a little bit slow, but let's see. Okay, don't kill me. Oh my gosh. Hey, okay, I understand. Kind of. Elephant gun. It's got 1.8 damage. Hmm, I'm not sure if it's even firing. Okay, let's see. The Homing Teeth of Terramorphous times 7. Okay, that's a nice corrosive option right there. And we have ourselves a good touch. Its fire rate is 28.2, but it is a Jacobs. Which one do I assume I'm not going to be using? Oh gosh, that one just scares me. I think this one has real potential. It's, n it's only 98,000 damage. Well, actually, that's not... Yeah, it's only it's only 98,000 damage times two. It actually looks kind of terrible. But the dot damage on it is kind of ridiculous. You know what? You got to give everything a try, though. So that's my problem with, with the completely randomized. Everything looks so good. We're dropping this pistol. Sorry. All right. Yeah, it's because it's semi-automatic is why its fire rate is so high. But either way, it might be a nice slag option for us. All right, so we made it out of the first room in the randomizer. Holy cow, we did it. Let's go. All right, so let's use this gun right away to see because this one's on the chopping block right now it, that dot damage was nice just like i predicted but can i deal with the annoying sound is the question i haven't even taken a look at my skill trees yet but i, I won't make you guys sit through that let's just go zero skill tree uh zero points for now why not us why not now then you're saying if you got anarchy you completely trolled if you took if you if you rolled anarchy you completely trolling right now might be true might not be true you don't know that much you don't know half as much as you think you know okay, you go down I do have more fire options. Okay, I, I got this puppy to try. Ooh, that was nice. That was nice. Come on, get in my zone. Get in my radius of, of influence here. And you know what? That's probably a, in a situation where we'd much rather have an SMG than the fire to the Terramorphous, honestly. You don't have to worry about the, me accidentally rolling anarchy and not putting points into it and not stacking. I wish there were more skills in the game. I, this was something that I was th considering putting in my poll, my post on Joel Stutz's community um, post about what we got, we will, what we would want to see in like the final patch of uh, of Rogue Lance. But I want to see more stacking mechanics um, added into the game. Uh, something that a lot of other uh, roguelites do. Now, try to find example. Uh, the sound, okay. You know, the sound, unfortunately, it, it's just a little bit too much for me. So we're gonna be we're gonna be looking for a replacement SMG from this one as soon as possible. This is a, an absolutely enormous damage launcher. That is 10 million damage. That's, that's close to the highest damage I've ever seen. Did you see that shot? If that hits, right? That goes nuts. Yeah. If it hits, it goes nuts. Yeah, it one shots. Okay, that was a that was a really big one shot. Okay, fifteen out of fifteen. We got a lot of weapons to look at. I mean, we're here. We're doing it. Okay, so this fire gun, unfortunately, the the sound is a little bit too much for me. I think this weapon has some potential. Oh, those rockets going out of it. What if I cheat and hit P? Yeah, those are rockets. Okay. By the way, third person mode. Pretty nice, huh? I like it. Look at that. 
So yeah, the, the photo. I'm, I'm running a photo mode mod right now. We have 10 points to spend, but let's go ahead and get our stuff. I'm not going to hit the pressure plate. Maybe I should. I think having at least something that you know is good going into each round is important. So I think this gun can probably go. This true lane doesn't slag me. It may or may not slag me, but the, this gun this gun is probably the worst one I picked up so far today. Okay, let's see. This fire at that's not bad fire rate. Let's go to the pressure pad and take it. I guarantee you there's at least someone thinking about just going to the comment section right now and telling me to spend my points. And you know what? Feel free to do it. Feel free to do it. Um, 944. The fire rate's only 1.1, though. Don't speak to me. Let's see, we were. I'll take the Aquamarine Snyder, but it's the only one I'm. I'm really considering here. The convergence is okay. Having something that's shock damage is going to be helpful. Because thinking about it with uh, with the randomized guns, not knowing what you what you have is is really difficult because <clears throat> a lot of these bosses only have one type of weakness. And so it's like, well, if I don't know what I'm shooting, then I kind of limit what I can do. <clears throat> Let's see, a Shock Tattler. It's got 176,000 damage times what? Times 15. Its magazine size is atrocious, so unless it's really hitting hard, it's going to be terrible. I think this one can probably go. We're going to keep this bad Larry on. This gun has a lot of potential too, because loaders are going to be hit by that. It's going to be, lot, it's going to be really easy to hit loaders with this gun, because of the way they're shaped, and it's, that's that's what we're really looking to do there. I don't have any faith in that in that shotgun. Okay, uh, those might home in on enemies, but the sound, the sound just goes completely insane. I don't think I gave. Did I give this good touch a try? I think I did. Yeah, yeah, I definitely did. I was using it for slag. Okay, let's see. A Sir Hammerlock slagger. It's 1.17 million times three with a very slow fire rate. Okay, the fire rate's not even that bad. We're definitely going to be thinking about using that. Let's see, a failed conference call. We can replace the fire rockets with it. Let's see. Ooh. Yeah. Now that's what I'm talking about. Its max size is uh, infinite, or what's going on here? Its max size is 200. Its fire rate is 100. Its damage is 3 million times 6. Ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so I have to. I should be trying these grenades. Let's just pick up a grenade, chuck it. We have an immunity, so we can't die. Simple grenade, not going to use it. Sticky homing something. It's homing, so we d we're not going to be able to tell what it does. Unless, of course, we throw it in here. Don't leave. Don't leave. Let me see. One oh one point oh point nine update gonna carry its weight here in gold. Doesn't look like it did much. Okay. How about a bouncy Kzar? Stay in here. Okay, it doesn't really bounce. Chuck one more. It's just lobbed. Okay, and how about this bad puppy? Oh, it's like a it's a I think it's longbow, and it's I mean it might slag them. Yeah, if we have to try everything, right? We should, probably be, we should be shooting everything. Let's see. I think that this gun has a lot of potential. What's that damage on that? It is 1.6 million times 16. Against fleshy enemies. That could be a Terramorphous Destroyer. This is 500,000 times 14, and it should it should replace something that... It should be a really good slag option. Okay, you know what? And it's time to take our points. I could, I could try, like, a no-points challenge, or what I could do, realistically, is go no-kill, like, overkill. A little bit of two-fang. All right, let's roll. I have four more points I can put in, too. The rust yards. The yards of rust. What I'm going to do, actually, is I'm going to take chain reaction. Or close enough, I should say. 
because I'm going to be using this conference call. And I think it might just be the, the it, it's in contention probably for one of the most the greatest drops I've ever seen in Borderlands 2. And like how do you how do you say that just like so calmly, you know? <laughs> We've seen a lot. And this one might be up there. Oh, that, that reload speed, though. Boom. Get back in there. Yeah. Contraband skyrocket. Let's take it. Let's throw it. See what it does. It does skyrocket to the moon. Longbow transfusion. Please do what you say you do. It longbows. Does it transfusion? Oh my goodness, we did it. We got, we got a randomized transfusion grenade. Unbelievable. You would have never thought it could be. Okay, so do we really cons need to go down this skill tree anymore? I think interspersed outburst is nice. I'm going to take chain uh, close enough. I need something for ammunition purposes. This is not a bad skill tree at all. Especially because Gage has no melee over at cooldown. This getting scorned fixes my a lot of my problems. Okay. Let's actually just let's skip to my loot buckle mushy on to the next round. I, I feel pretty strong. I think that we should have at least first tier one, we should have a decent enough build. Feeling good, like I should. Feeling blessed, never stressed. But the, the change that I did end up asking Jolts to put into the game was to remove the tier system and just make it like a longer a longer run, say like 20 rounds, and have like 18 and 19 be the raid boss uh, raid bosses, and then 20 be dragons or something along those lines. This one says transfusion and it and it has transfusion on the card. And also we might let's look at some different shields. This one is 1.1 million, 1.5 million, 2.3 million. Okay. With a not with a not terrible delay. It's not bad. We still haven't used Death Trap yet, but like, do, do we really have to? I don't think so. Imagine getting bored with this build. I mean, it would absolutely go off. It would it would, it would actually go to the heat to the ether. More guns to try out though. And I need to get my launcher to slot four. Something that I didn't do before. I'm a poet and I didn't even know it. Oh, the the close enough is just so insane. I can't get rid of this gun. It's just too insane. Multi 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 pelt weapons officially go absolutely insane for us. We're playing gauge with close enough. That reload though is atrocious. I do have a lot of ways to keep my reload, but something has got to go. Not a bad pistol, but let's see what else we got here. It's gonna go crazy. That's the problem with what I got right now. Every, everything, everything is going to go crazy. You know what? I think taking multi pellet weapons is, is seemingly, seemingly just the way to go. Let's go. I want. To, I want at least at least try this grenade. I think I wiped these lads, and it's, it should be the ones back here spawning. This is one of the stages that I'm usually concerned about, because there's almost exactly 15. I think there is exactly 15 enemies to fight on this stage. And I'm concerned about getting soft locked. But anyways, back to what I was saying at the very beginning of my mobbing stage 1. I, I, I wish there was more ways to stack in the game. It, like a like a roguelite like uh, Bellatro, right? It has jokers in the game that every time you play a full house, because Bellatro is a poker roguelite, every time you play a full house, um, it can get better or something like that. And so each subsequent thing you do of the same thing makes it better. Stacking mechanics, uh, Gunfire Reborn, the the eagle character. Every time you get an execute with your sweep with your leg sweep, your subsequent leg sweeps get stronger. I think something like that could should have you know it has a place and anarchy is one of those but there's a, but there's only that a slag seeker 
800 oh, man I, I gotta try right so is there anything that we're not particularly I'm gonna save this slag weapon right here sorry to the slag we, we already give it a try very interesting but it has the sound sorry Malawan is it all Malawans Yeah, all Malawans have that sound. That's crazy, huh? Poor Malawan. So trash. By the way, are we softlocked? We might be softlocked. Now, there's, of course, there's a, there's, with me, there's always a way out. Because I'm kind of like the goat of all time. Watch this. I never get softlocked. That's the, that's the crazy part about me. By the way, backpack mod. I've got 150, 150 backpack space, so. Watch me work. Please tell me I can grenade jump out of here. Yes, I can. Okay. Oh, Mr. Robatos. I am here to destroy you. Thank you. Let's roll out. Take my five points. One point interspersed outburst. Why not? Since we're there. And. Elemental elation. It's healing. Of what sort? Mm, I'm going to have slag. I think it'll be healing me a little bit. So don't at me, okay? You're like, take the reload speed. Take the reload speed. I'm not taking it. We'll come back. Listen, we gotta. We, we have a weapon. I feel like what we might start doing is you just you go until you have something that just completely breaks the game, and then you just get to the next tier. And, just, and like that, and just hope to that your skills can carry you. I think. I mean, I played several rounds of the randomizer now, where you don't get something that breaks the game. Like you, you just don't get something like this that just wipes the map. It's too good. It's three million times six, and, and it's just the projectiles just go everywhere. And I'm taking those projectiles with my close enough and multiplying them. As long as I remain accurate, I feel comfortable. It... All right, elemental empathy down to I would say I'm the juggernaut. We're gonna go pretty defensive. Pretty, pretty defensive. All right, it's going to be the dwarf. Mr. Dwarf. And then I can get my shotgun to use up a little bit, but I don't want to fully commit the shotgun to use. However, I do have a feeling that this gun, even if it does lose some of its base damage, it still might be pretty good because it's, it's max size roll 200. So, also this homing grenade is not, I don't have that grenade on anymore. I want my longbow transfusion. Oh my gosh, look at this one. Please do what you say you do. Oh my gosh, you are so insanely overpowered. By the way, speaking of insanely overpowered. Okay, something that we know works. Oh my gosh, something that you know works. You take that pin for now. I'm really sorry to people that want me to go full random. And you know what? If you have to hit the dislike button, hit the dislike button. I do not care. I'm I'm not going to be using it right now. But it will be something that I will be using in the future. By the way, this grenade. That's not fair. Okay, so. Juggernaut. Scorn. Let's do... Do we stack damage reduction? I don't think we do. So we already have 20 damage reduction, 20% damage reduction. What I'm interested in most of all is actually more damage from interspersed outbursts. I'm already, I'm already juicing it. Let's go fight our first raid boss. I'm not going to hit box. I'm going to spend SDUs. It just makes more sense. It just makes more sense. All right, start with shoddy. Then go Grenage. Then go launcher. Let's roll. Okay, wham bam. This should be fine. The this guy typically gets shredded by ricochet weapons because they can hit multiple of his crit spots. But we will see, won't we? Bring it on, crawl. I have scorn now. Yeah, this guy gets absolutely ripped apart by multi-pellet weapons. 
he wants that ricochet and hit all of his crits. This guy just, I don't know what it is about it, but he just gets ripped apart. If only I had boar. Like, that, that's the one thing I'm missing. Yeah, I can just wipe the whole map just by shooting at the ground. It's ridiculous. Uh, mag size is just... It's, t it's literally 200. Making this thing just a... A powerhouse. Oh my gosh. How was this one? It doesn't even have a name. Hey. Curse of the Elementals. I don't want that. I don't want curses. There's no reason to take the curse debuffs, I don't think. We're, we're killing everything too fast. They don't have time to spawn in. Did we get a reload off? I don't think so. Don't need it. It's only eating two bull, two pellets per shot, so it's like it's just like it's just insanely overpowered. By the way, the over the reason why it's doing so much is because the overkill damage transfers to the next target, and then if that gets boosted by interspersed outburst. So like, there's no way for anything to realistically survive. Like, no kill, like overkill is adding my overkill damage to the next shot. And then I, I then take that. And by the way, the loot enemies, they, they'll give you gear, but it's not going to be like, you know, legend is legendary. It's not like regular rogue lands. Randomized. There we go. Easy tier one. Really, really no, no reason to stick around because every gear, all the gear that we get from the section is going to be randomized once we load back into the main menu and then go back into the game between tiers. Which is sad. We, you keep the weapon. You keep the weapon, but the rolls on it, the rolls on it get changed. So I will show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. And sometimes the names of the guns change too. They get shortened. I think that you, you lose a lot of... It might, it might be your accessories. I'm not too sure. But I'll show you guys right here. By the way, that's an, an absolute speed run of that parkour course. Just want to point that out. So it's a failed conference call with 30 million damage times 6, accuracy 16.5, fire rate 100, reload speed 6.9, and magazine size 200. So as we enter tier 2, so the enemies now have, they're going to be scaling higher. So they're going to be increasing their, their level. Wait, did I go back to the main menu there? I don't think I did. Did you see that? No, but I, okay, look at, the, the gun is different. It does not have the same, it does not have the same damage. Does it have the same ricochet? Its accuracy is much, much lower, and its magazine size is only one now. It's supposed to be 200. It says 200 on the card, and it's only one. But I think what happens is, they get changed back to their original versions almost. So what I like to do between tiers is just take a look at what I have in the bank. And a lot of it you can't really tell. Ooh, let's take a leech here. Even though when I think when I throw it, nothing will happen. Yeah, it's a fake. I like to take a look back at what I have. And since since I, I took a whole bunch of... See, this one's just called a shotgun now. And it can only fire twice, even though it says mag size 10. It does not. It, oh, it does consume five ammo per shot, which is crazy. This is still a good shotgun. It's just the problem with it is that you can only fire it once. It's so sad what happened to this gun, unfortunately. So let's just take a look at all of our, all of our weapons that we... So uh, one reason why I kept my Pimpernel around was for this exact situation. I can now have something that I know is good while I look through the other pieces of gear. Okay, this is 328,000 times 13. Fire rate is 12. Could have potential. Could definitely have potential. Not like game-breaking potential, but like usable potential.
I'm just looking for things with super high damage and then cross-referencing with fire rate. That's all I'm doing. I do have an assault rifle. Ooh, assault rifle damage plus 41%. Shock damage plus 50%. Absolutely, we use the shock damage one because I'm going to be increasing my gun damage with assault rifles right here. I'm going to be giving it... I'm going to give it a chance. I'm going to give this gun a chance to show me. Show me something. This is the show me state. Okay. Like this launch route. Not necessarily what I'm looking for. Okay. I like what I'm seeing out of you. I like what I'm seeing out of you. Death Trap. We're, we, we're not OP anymore. I need your help. Oh, yeah. I definitely need your help. Can I get a reload off, please? Thank you. That reload, that reload is getting is gonna get me killed here. Okay. Oh, I should, should be scoring over the top. Yeah, that's gonna really help. That's my bad. Maintain this slag. I have the reason why I'm not too worried right now is because I have a lot of. By the way, I want to try it out a different gun. This guy's shooting rockets. This guy's shooting rockets. Got to take this guy down. Do something that we know works. He's shooting rapid fire rockets. The only reason we're not dead right now is because Death Trap tanked it. And now he dies for it. That's crazy. I'm really sorry, Death Trap. Hey, okay. Okay, so. Sorry, full damage. Incendiary damage. Those are two great relics to pick up. You're looking for something that can push me over the edge. Got a pimper now. This gun has potential. This is 986,000 damage times 6 with a large magazine size. Oh, and it fires world burn rockets. Okay. Which means we can go into our inventory and take off shock damage. Put on something different. Anything different doesn't really matter. Look at all these. Everything just turned into a sorrowful damage. It's crazy. Sure, slag resistance. Why not? Take the interspersed house burst one. There we go. Bring it on. I have died on this stage before. I the stage can be difficult. Later, kid. Okay. So I I think reload speed matters a lot now. We're gonna be taking a lot of it. We can take killer as well. We're gonna be reload speeded out of our gourd. Okay, I'm hoping this gun can kind of carry me. Okay, I'm fine. Everything is fine. Everything is absolutely fine here. Just fire towards the red dots. Uh oh, this is not good. Chain downs is not what I was looking to have happen. That trap, get out here. Yeah. Come on. Hit your targets. Hit your targets. I, I took shotgun SDU is the reason why I'm primarily using shotguns if I can. This is the one thing that I'm invested in. I trusted that shotgun to come back and and still be good, but this firestorm could be insane. Uh, let's see this rubberized chain lightning. Does it do it? As... Ooh, I kind of like that. Let's do it. Oh my gosh, she spawned right on top of me. That's a joke, right? Holy cow. Yeah, one shot though. That, that grenade was crazy. Okay, so. I think Redeem the Soul is a really important skill. I think Killer is important too. Let's take a little bit of healing on Overkill. Let's do it. Tier 2, we're coming for you. We we pick up weapons, we shoot. That's why we shoot just about everything. Alright. Oh, not my best effort, to be honest with you. I, I've had efforts way better than that in the past. Let's keep going on this laddie though. Okay, that trap, I need your help. This launcher is not really doing it, or this shotgun is not really doing it right now. Everything seems to be okay, though. We're getting through the round. Oh, I'm not getting through the round. We're not getting through the round. I'm definitely die here. Thank God I took extra points in to fight for my lifetime, actually. Okay. We're doing it. But we're looking for uh, a replacement. This is now a nine 
This launcher is going. I think this launcher is going to remain good. It's going to remain good for sure. This launcher is doing great things. Pimpernel stays on. Don't care. Let's replace this SR rifle. I don't trust it. It's got negative fire rate. Sniper rifle damage. Thank you. Ooh, and a max ammo relic. That's not bad at all. In fact, let's actually equip it. Okay, am I getting punked? I think I am getting punked. Is that crazy or what? It disappeared into the ether. This is double sniper rifle max ammo. That's crazy. Yeah, the, my, my relics are getting just absolutely randomized this a ridiculous amount right now. You seeing this? Elemental relic now. If I just spam this, will I just will I end up getting just a random like OP relic into the spot? Looks like it, honestly. Looks like unless you put one of these like pre-made ones on, then you're you're stuck in that for that fate to that fate forever. I kind of want to put back on this shock, this shock damage setup here. It seemed like it was doing a little bit better for us, but where did, did I get my shock damage? Is that gone forever? My shock damage relic? Yeah, it's gone forever. That's fine. We we'll continue on. It's, it's it's that it's that time in the menus that really helps, you know, get your build put together and stuff like that. We know this gun works. It might not be you know the one that you talk that you talk to talk about with your family back at, at the end of the day, but it's still gonna work for you. Elemental elation. Heal me just a little bit here. A bit of reload speed too. Not bad. Someone's flying directly above me. This is a difficult stage regardless of... Oh my goodness. Yep. I'm in trouble now. I'm in a lot of trouble now. We have to just start... Start juicing up our... Our rocket launcher here and hope. And pray. Oh, there's a jet loader right there. Oh, we're so back. Everyone thought the run was over there. Literally everyone thought the run was over there. But we live. Oh man. Wow. That was crazy. This assault rifle came up so clutch right there. Try, try, trying to get one more spawn in. There we go. We're, we are in the market for something that can take our game to the next level. Okay, what came? What what is here? Baby maker? It's not even a. I just don't trust it. Let's put five points into. We're gonna have a, a lot of health regen. Let's put some points into able, even though sustenance is. 4% of missing health, which makes sustenance a little bit worse than able, I think. Okay, we're going to have to replace something. I think the Pimpernel is going to go back into our back pocket. 904,000 damage. It doesn't shoot anything. Unfortunate. Splat gun me. It doesn't shoot anything. Unfortunate. Hive me. It does shoot something. How accurately? I'm not too sure. Infinity? It does have the infinity property, but its fire rate is slower than molasses. What about this baby maker? Has potential. Definitely has potential. Can it show up and show out in an Oni, in an o assassin Oni round? Maybe. Okay, I see the potential in my in its eyes. I see the. I see the fight in it. So can it can it juice me there? There we go. 
I definitely think it's like it's trying to tell me right now like I'm your man I'm your man but like I just look across the aisle at something like this bad boy and I'm like which which one of you can I trust more you know thank you death trap hold him down for me okay let's get our dots up a little bit and that's for the outer sheriff's badge or anything like that Is much, much better against these lower health enemies that do more damage. Bandits. Make no mistake, though. Oni resists explosive damage, so I'm going to need to mix it up. I'm just trying to clear everybody else out. Not bad. Indirect fire is the way. Indirect fire is the way. This... The shotgun's definitely putting up is definitely doing a great job. It's just a it's just a yellow jacket. Never underestimate the, the power of the, the scout's code, you know what I'm saying? Alright, buddy. You can do it. That's not, not bad only damage, but you reload you have to reload a lot here. I should probably go for crits. How about you? How do you do against Oni? You actually don't do bad. You don't do bad. I'm gonna hold it against you. I don't know who's over here, but you gotta go. I don't, I don't want anybody around while I'm fighting Oni. I just want a 1v1 fight. It's really not bad. I think this one might be a little bit better. Not bad. Okay. I do... I'm still in the market for something. Okay, auto-correcting Shredifier. It's 662,000 damage times 5. It's actually 100. It's fire rate 7.7. Potential. Potential, 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 potential. It's just screaming it. It's screaming it. The shock one, I'm actually going to replace it for now. With this plasma caster? No. How about this interfacer? Potential. Potential. It shoots really slow, though. I know someone is probably like, you, you've had Metal Storm here the whole time. Why are you not taking it? Listen, I'm all, I'm all about let the weapons carry. And we just, I'm the wielder of it. You know what I'm saying? My job is to wield the weapon. I have... I have pistol badges, too. I can slap on at any time. And these are... These are not randomized. These are nice. Alright, Scorn. I think we're realizing its potential here. I haven't hit a single crit yet or anything. There we go. Got a crit damage up. I think... I think we are realizing its potential. It's got 100 accuracy. It's... It's going to be guaranteed... Multi pellet damage. That's a not a bad tier two Wilhelm kill. Not the fastest you'll ever see in the entire world, but it's a guaranteed Wilhelm kill. Okay, so I'm gonna take Mylan, and then I will take. I I, I really don't know. Tough call. Shoot the box, shoot the box, shoot shoot the arterial gift box. No. <laughs> I will not. So this time around it's pistol. Assault rifle. Launcher my launcher. SMG my SMG. Back and forth. Back and forth. We rip it and stick it. Mr. Pete. How do you do? I'm here to come and kill you. I'm telling you, it's guaranteed damage. How's this one do against them? The shock one that I picked up. Not, not nearly as good. Okay, so after I destroy his... After I destroy his shield, he's going to do a guaranteed... I think he does a guaranteed uh, Nova. I'm not really scared to just stay right where I am. Lends my debuff just like this.
Not bad. I, I need to get a debuff cleanse here. Thank you. Is that a power up? Yeah, it is. Okay. Thank you, Death Trap. I don't think I have a grenade that can really make use of it. I mean, maybe if I had a transfusion grenade. It's incendiary transfusion. If it does what it says it does, because my inventory is getting crazy buggy right now. If it does what it says it does, it should be good. It's not doing what it says it does. Unfortunately, with the, the gear randomized, the grenades kind of get a little, they do get a little bit wonky. All the gun stuff, very, very cool. Grenades, a little wonky. But this is a fast power P kill. I mean, if, you, if you've seen me fight power P in the channel before, you know, like, this is a pretty quick one. I need to get more crits off. I also need to get more slag off. That's, that hurts my feelings when you do that, you know, Mr. Peter? There we go. Get our iridium and then nothing else here really, really matters. But I do like, I think looking around and finding ones with uh, extra pellets could be somewhat useful. Either way, let's roll. Let's roll. Tier 3, here we go. Right side of me, right side of me, left side of me. But it's only one on the left. Then it's, oh my gosh, I can't believe I trolled it. But it's two right, then it's one left. Then it's two right again. Oh my gosh, it's not. Two right, one left, one right. Then it's two left, yeah, 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 yeah. And it's two left again. Wow. I should probably, I could honestly put a little, like, make a little picture and have it up on the screen for when I do that one. That'd be a lot of extra work when I can just run it. Okay, so, let's take a look at some of our guns. This interfacer lost a lot of its potential damage. The Shredifier, I think, still has potential. Now, the gun that I want to take a look at, and I'm taking a, a, especially a, a look at these pistols. The gun that I want to take a look at is my conference call that I was using in the very beginning. That shotgun conference call. Because if it gets its damage back, it could go to the moon. But is the reload speed fixed? Is the magazine size fixed? It is not. Which is a little bit sad. Plus fire rate and minus magazine size is not what really what I'm looking for. Weapon accuracy and reload speed is nice. I'm going to continue using this shred of fire. Until I get something different. That's a 1 million damage pitchfork. It might have multiple pellets. It's... Oh! oh. Okay, don't kill me. Okay, let's see. This one has a 7.7 .7 fire rate with 1.3 mil damage. I don't think it fires anything. So tragic when that happens, honestly. It's so tragic. I should probably should have taken a gub for guaranteed. Yeah, it doesn't shoot anything. A little unlucky. Go back to the well here. Scorn. Oh, do not fall off a cliff. No, no cliff falling. Wow, I was really close. This weapon still has potential. There we go. Not bad. That's just that's tier three, by the way. Tier three damage. Level eighty six enemies. So much better. It's crazy. I'm in the market for a better Grenage, that's for sure. I have redeemed the soul, which means I have extra fight for my lifetime. I have to get four more kills though here. This is going to be a little bit close for comfort. 
A little close for comfort. The ironclad or the bone crusher? Let's go for the bone crusher. There we go. Okay. So I think this this gun could still be useful. This one is not. So this is an easy replaceable. And how do our launcher do? I think our launcher made that alive. Sick. I don't think this bee will behave the way I want it to. Incendiary transfusion, please. No, doesn't. All right, how about a rubberized caustic leech? That one might do what it says it does. Let's go. Bee shield, let's listen. It's impossible to tell with that gun. We're going to try this shield out, but if it doesn't do B-shield things, then we're going to replace it. Okay, so. Let's... Accelerate will mess up some guns, and it's not the best buff anyways. So I don't really want to take it. To the gulag we go. Oh gosh, I still didn't get... Oh, it's dropping boosters, which makes me think that it's not the B-shield. What if it was? What if it was a booster sh No, I'm definitely not getting any bonus damage at all. Alright. Do I have anything to try? Not really. I mean, I have these bad puppies. Well, I need something that's way more accurate for this guy. That's trap. I don't know why I'm waiting. Let's get out here. Just rely on this pistol. It'll get you there. Come on, get us there. Got to get the I'm playing really close attention to the mobbing because these enemies can have randomized guns. I'm not sure which ones do and which ones don't. I'm making sure that I take it as seriously as I possibly can. Zapper Uncapped Herald. We have a gun. Our one, our one slot is completely open, so. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A little bit slow pellet speed, but I have Accelerate, which could make it better, but I don't think it's going to get there. This Cruddy Rock Gun doesn't do anything fancy. Means it's probably terrible. Unfortunately, the the inventory is so um when you take a reward at the end of the round, it gets randomized into your inventory something completely different. So at this point it'd be impossible to find, especially with my inventory acting the way it is now. I think that we want to go ward. Okay, let's see how this live mill fires. Yeah, it could have some potential. This is a times two with a whole bunch of bonus crit damage. Potential. It's got potential. Let's keep looking though. Grenages. I haven't, I haven't got, given this one a chance to do what it says it does. Sticky Loud Match Missile. Hmm. How about this bad puppy? Doesn't do anything. Okay, it's not terrible. How about a Rubberized Merv? Okay. Honestly, I think I'm just going to go for a... This chain lightning, yeah, I, I kind of like this one. I mean, it's a decent grenade. It's gonna heal me up with elemental empathy at the very least. Hmm. Storm, whiskey tinker, foxtrot, saw bar. If I, if I, gotten a B shield there, I think I'd take it. But since no B shield, no take. That I, I think the B shield's more of like a. a a supportive element more than like a main character a lot of the time. How about a 26,000 damage infection? Looks, my one slot is completely open right now. All right, let's see this one. Kind of lame. Okay. Continue on. 
We're looking for a deputy's badge, is what we're looking for. That way we can juice up shotguns the same way we're juicing up pistols and assault rifles, but it is what it is. Okay. More gear, please. Okay, we can't can't afford to be too too uh risky here. Let's just use our pistol that we know works. Alright, death trap, you fight him in there. I will go over here. Use our pistol that we know works. And I want to see if I can get find that pistol back again. This interface got a faster fire rate though. Let's try this one out. We got a faster fire rate. That was the one thing that was holding it back before was a horrendous fire rate. And now that we have that fire rate, maybe it can start doing something. Maybe. Get the, get the heals going. Get the heals going. Oh my gosh, we're going to die. Go to my number three spot. Start shooting at the ground. Never mind. Use this gun. Oh, we're so back. Okay. Please live. Please live. Oh, we don't live. We don't live. We don't live. We don't live. Reload me. Yes. Because of my close enough skill, I don't have to exactly hit them with this launcher. I can just shoot it. Okay. Give me that booster pack. Later. Well, that doesn't do as much damage to him. He's got nice def defenses. Ooh, later, kids. Use what you know works. Use what you know works. Tough enemy to hit. That's not so, so bad. This gun kind of really sucks, huh? Decent stripping shields, but it reloads so, so much. I'm so happy that we have this. Have our... Slag taken care of with scorn. There, kid. Ooh. Okay. So this interfacer has got to go. Do we have anything that can come in and take its place? Yeah. We haven't tried this SMG yet. Let's try it. Okay. Shock, kiss of death. It does fire and shock. Or is it just is it just a lie? That's what's so crazy to me. A lot of these grenades just simply lie about what they do. At least this one doesn't, you know? Let's see. My one slot is somewhat open, my two slot is not open, my three slot is. Slag orc. I think that this gun has some potential. Multiple pellets. Or not multiple pellets, it just shoots so fast and makes it look like it's multiple pellets. I think maybe... We go... We have a lot of options. Headshot makes sense for the increased crit. Let's go fill to the brim. I like magazine size and I like carry capacity. Alright, Southpaw, Steam, and Power. Let's run it. I want to try this new gun out, which means I'm going to want to put mouthwash on. And let's put on a assault rifle gun damage. What happened to my gun? Wait, is this the wrong gun? Do I have the wrong gun on? Oh, it's just when I aim down sight, it's, it's, it's burst. Very interesting. Okay. Just fire into nothingness. Go. I should die. Reload me. Is that gonna be enough to kill dragons without dying? Maybe. <laughs> That's what it's all about now. That's what it's all about now. Alright. Come on. You can do this. I believe in you. Oh, that, that's a that's a nice kill. I mean, maybe? I think it can get the job done. I think it could get the job done. I think it, I think it has potential. I think that this slag orc might have potential to take us to the promised land. Let's go. Get us there. 
get us there. <laughs> Please. <laughs> okay, so. Let's take... I have a lot of health regen going on, and I like that. I would like to get some more... Let's say... Let's just give us some more gun damage. It's 15%. It's not terrible. Okay, while we have Metal Storm, let's just keep up the fire here. That's a one-shot. That's an absolute one-shot. Yeah, this gun definitely has the juice. Oh, yeah. It's got juice, for sure. Oh, 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 yes, we found it. it it's it's going to get us there. It's definitely going to get us there. Give me a B-Shield. No B-Shield. Oh, a peak opener. <laughs> you thought that... You thought that your 600,000 damage per shot was going to be enough? <laughs> oh, that's classic, bro. Classic. Get out of here. Don't speak to me. Let's max out our SDUs and keep the extra 300,000 for ourselves and fight some dragons. This is why we take Gage. We take Gage because we have Death Trap. And Death Trap is the most useful action skill for fighting the dragons. Is it more useful than Salvador's Gunzerk? Hot take. Yes. Give it a reload off. I'm going to let Death Trap do most of the work from the beginning here. I'm going to let him bring down who he wants to bring down. Unfortunately, he brought down the only dragon that I don't do that much damage to. Can I still... Can I still kill this lad, even though he's slag immune? I can. It's going to be expensive. There you go, Death Trap. You do... You do all the early work. I will... I will just do the deeps. Okay? There we go. Slag is down. You bring down who you want to bring down, Death Trap. I'm going to make sure that we are, our ammo is topped up. I would like to get boost if I can if I could help it. Looks like we got red, which means I'm not even gonna shoot at red. I'm just gonna shoot at the dragons in the sky. Maybe not the best idea. Now that I'm thinking about it. Then they'll aggro me. When they should be just aggroing death trap. Okay. Now we can shoot at red. You've made a mistake, brother. I know that and I know that you know that. All right, let's go. Um, I want green down here. Just in, that's, a, that's a definite just in case me. Big just in case me right there. So a thousand rounds less than this is sorry full. A green. I thought I. I thought I. Yeah. There we go. Very nice. And then there was one helium the invincible. Can sometimes be a major problem, but not this time. I have the gear. Oh yeah, I've got. I have the gear. GG, fireworks me. Okay, it's gonna say where are my fireworks. Oh man, nice, an awesome run. Really an awesome run. Well, thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed the run, hit the like button, subscribe to see more videos like this one, and I will see you all in the next one. See ya.